So what happened with your daughter? So in front of the whole family, she's like, Mom, so are you a virgin? <gasps> I thought, and we've had sex talks, and I know that she knows what it means. So I looked at her and sort of perplexed and then said, oh, well, we've talked about this. So, of course, you know I'm not a virgin. And she said, no, now I'm confused because... I know that you said you've tried for a baby, but you don't have a baby. So that, I don't know. Did you not do it right? Are you a virgin? It's like, oh my gosh. How do you explain that to her? I said, I said, I'm not a virgin. Just because you don't have a baby doesn't mean that you're not a virgin. And I said, but you're a virgin. And that's good. <laughs> 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 so, I, I don't know. I was like, I need to bust out these American Girl doll books again that talk about things. Uh, yeah, we got to have some more in-depth talks. Because I thought we had addressed some of it, and I knew there's more to come. But <clears throat> I think the time is now. Yeah, she's 13? 13. Oh, yeah. But Right, 13, but also not really. She's 13 chronologically. Logically, but like emotionally, mentally, she's behind because of her like growing up in the orphanage, not having the upbringing that a lot of 13 year olds have had. Did you see there was a very rare gene that some women, they do not need any sort of pain relief during childbirth? Like it doesn't hurt. That's amazing. Crazy, huh? You talking about being a virgin, Mm -hmm. having babies? Women who don't need an epidural might be carriers of the rare genetic variant that gives them an extremely high threshold for pain. They talk about how it's like one in hundreds of women have this variant, and it's all different. Some people don't feel it doesn't hurt at all. Mm -hmm. Some people it hurts way less. And that people are like, oh, it wasn't that bad. They kind of have more of this gene than people who are like, oh, that it's not really, they're just tougher. They just feel it differently. Isn't that wild? I I don't think I have that. I mean, I've never given birth, but I have a feeling if I were to ever give birth, it'd be super painful. My girlfriend has the an extreme pain tolerance. Wild. Oh. I have. I don't. I'm, mm-hmm. a, I'm a baby boo boo. But she, you can pinch her. You, she's like, try me. Mm, doesn't hurt her at all. Really? Yeah. It's weird. That is crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But how great would it be to have lunchbox your wife? Did it hurt? Oh, hurt so bad. <laughs> she went in with plans to not use an epidural, and I mean, about an hour into it, she's like. Epidural me. Epidural. Let's go. Is it go. too late, though, to do that then? No. Luckily, she because they, they give you a, a timeline off, where there's a cutoff, and she was before the timeline. My mom, on the other hand, she did all three kids. No epidural. No so, problem. I, sometimes I just come in here and want an epidural. That's how. Is that that we, painful for my, you? Yes. Here? Just hmm. waking up early in the morning, you know? How much that cost? <laughs> <laughs>